Welcome back to DSG, where we are in SnowRunner. <laughs> uh, maybe I should have practiced that a little bit more. I'm trying to do a little bit of rebranding, so uh, we might as well get this out of the way. But if you like today's episode, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. That would help out a lot. Uh, the, logarithm, the, logarithm, the algorithm of YouTube seems to be changed. I don't know what happened. I'm not really sure what's going on, uh, but anyways, any any likes, any comments, and any subscribe subscribers will uh, help out the channel tremendously. But uh, yeah, we're in the process of trying to get this, uh, both these trucks, over to the step here, where hopefully we can uh, go ahead and repair it, and uh, yeah, maybe we'll even bring, be able to bring it home. Uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to have to squeeze our way up through here. We're going to go past it to that point and then come back to it. So uh, it may be possible to cut through this way, but I won't know for sure until we get there. So let's get underway. We've got service trailers, we've got fuel tankers, and uh, yeah, we should have more than enough. Let's go ahead and turn on our... Uh, yeah, let's make sure that we accept this. I think we have. Uh, yes, we have accepted it. So you just you never know. With that last glitch I had, I, I'm hoping those couple of tasks were activated with uh, once I complete some missions. I'm hoping that's the case. Uh, but if I'm wrong, uh, I really don't know what to do about that. Uh, it's kind of a bummer. Uh, let's turn that engine back on. Not sure how that gets turned off. But, uh, yeah, let's get, uh, let's get over there. Do I, I don't do I? Oh, I do go that way. Good. I'm already screwing things up, like, normal, so it's, it's an average day of, uh, streaming, or, of, uh, recording today. And yeah, I am, uh, I'm, I'm really tempted to try streaming this game. Should uh should come off the well Nobody will ever know that I've never streamed before in my life, so uh definitely wanna set that up and get that uh on the table as an option for uh doing videos, so anyways, it's a good thing we've got a sword. Uh probably should have uh probably should have refueled before trying to this river crossing, but uh, you know what, we'll hopefully get across and refuel there. Or we run out and then we refuel it, so either way we're probably getting wet. Long truck, you can do it. Maybe we can actually get out of the mud. I mean, ideally, we don't need to, <laughs> to be able to refuel, but it, uh, it would be a little bit nicer in real life to uh, get on top of the hill, get out of the mud, and uh, do our refueling up here. Definitely not necessary for this game. Alright, well, this, uh, that was close. There doesn't really seem to be a dry patch of land up here. I guess we, uh, yeah, I guess this is probably close enough. So let's go ahead and refuel us. Uh, we put, I guess the maintenance frame on. Um, so the source is that one, sorry. Let's fuel up this truck and the other truck. We've got, uh, what is it? Five or 600 gallons behind us? We don't have any fuel on the truck behind us, but we have a ton of spare parts, which we need that for the step, so. And ideally, I would want to leave these items on this map anyways, because there, there is a garage, but we haven't, uh, we haven't actually accessed it yet, so. If you look, it says, garage is not discovered, so. 
we will have to get that. Let's get back. And, uh, yeah, that's probably going to be our next goal. This map is going to be pure mud in the center. Uh, yeah, we'll turn on the headlights just for a little bit more clarity. It's, I still wish you could set the time of day to be static. I, I'd kind of prefer that. I don't really like the night driving. For streaming. It's nice for gameplay, but streaming and recording it's it's not the best option. And then uh, yeah, the uh, Russia there's a lot of a lot of fog. And that just makes it harder to see. So ideally new time would be the best. I'm sure there's probably a mod that I don't know how to install that would do it, but you know what? It's just gonna be the way it is. Um, yeah, so. Oh, well, you know what? I've got two trucks, but we're fine. This is uh, a little on the small side, though. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so. I think that's where our truck is. Wow, that was awfully deceiving. There is no way we were getting through that forest up there to get to the stuff there, so. Um, we're gonna have to do some thinking. I think we're just gonna have to go out wide. And possibly cut back through the forest here. I mean, we could do a 20 point turn, but. That would uh, risk us probably tipping over. Uh, small, small break in the trees there that we probably sneak through. Fingers crossed. There is a stupid pine branch there that would probably stop us. Nope, oh, sneak under it. I know we're kind of coming off the path right now. How are you feeling? Okay, the other truck has uh, latched onto it. Let's see if I can try to pull this through. There we go. Alright, perfect. Sometimes it's best not to uh, to go on the roads or to go on the trails. Sometimes it's best just to uh, go off the beat path. And we're stuck for no apparent reason. <laughs> ah, these boulders are killing me. That, um, that hurt a little bit. Alright, so let's, uh, let's go ahead and repair. So, oh, nope, wrong truck. Step needs the gas tank. That's probably most important. We've got five out of five wheels. We've got the engine, suspension, and we are out of points in this truck. Ah, uh, you know what? We can throw the spare wheel on it, too. I know it's off the truck, but it's fine. Um, Alright, and then the... Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and detach the winch. This truck up and out. We're going to change back to the other truck. To the Vaughn D53233. That's a, that's a mouthful right there. Uh, Alright, let's uh, repair, 
finish the suspension and the gearbox. Alright, now we can refill it and we should, uh, I wonder if we get to keep this truck. Not 100% sure. If I refilled the correct vehicle, that would uh, help out a lot. Alright, cool, we got to keep it. Awesome. Now we have a step. The only issue is... It's stuck. So, it's, um... There's no way this truck made it out here. Alright, well let's throw it all-wheel drive. It's got a pretty long frame. Small cap, it's an older truck, for sure. And it does have a diff lock, so I mean, maybe it did make it out here. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and recover this. Let's check it out real quick. See what we can do with it. I don't I don't think it's a popular truck for using, but you never know. Everyone has their own opinions. Let's go ahead and customize it. Uh, Raise suspension. Oh, it's lost. Somewhere out in the wild. Uh, let's see what size tires we've got. We got 43 inch tires. That's not fantastic. Uh, they seem pretty basic. We do have chain, so that's nice. Uh, you will have a snorkel, which always comes in handy. The frame. Typical, almost most of them. <laughs> uh, we do get this one, which is a little nice, the metal detector. That will come in handy for uh, certain missions. Gearbox is pretty much, yeah, everything but high, uh, fine tune is unlocked. Uh, and that we can't even find until we get to Wisconsin, so that should be a, a nice one. Uh, we got to get that engine in the Yukon. That's far. That's a long ways away. Uh, but that one's pretty good. Power weight, fuel consumption drops a little bit with it. I don't know. Like, I almost feel like this one's better than the TA220. Anyways. Yeah, so that truck is... Uh, yeah, there you go. That's pretty much what you can do. So let's go ahead and uh, I don't think I'm going to be using this one. Let's store it and we'll sell the thing. It's ni almost $90,000. That's that's pretty pretty decent. There's, there's so many vehicles here that I probably could sell. I'm, I'm not going to lie here. Um, the Tartra is a pretty decent one. Eh, anyway. Alright, let's uh let's go ahead and go back to where were we? Oh wow, we're all the way back in the ground lines. I totally forgot that we don't have a map anywhere near uh where we're at right now. So uh I want if that's the as off maybe Let's go with this as off. We're gonna we're gonna go try to find some uh, upgrades, and hopefully. Oh no! I totally forgot. This truck is on its side. All right, never mind. Let's uh let's take the Veron Veron D. We haven't uh we haven't actually really used this truck on its own. We've got fuel tanker. Well, We'll bring that along. And uh, unfortunately, we're kind of heading in the opposite direction. So I think what I'm going to do is uh, maybe go for this upgrade. And I think we're going to go this way. And then we're going to we're going to head into the unknown and try to go after the watchtower slash. Garage, that's what I was thinking. I knew upgrades wasn't the right thing. Yeah, so we're gonna go up for the uh, watchtower slash garage and try to open that up. But hopefully we can get uh, get this map taken care of. It's, it's 
rather small map. Um, I'm not really sure how many tasks are on it, but I'm going to guess because of the size, it should be less than normal size map. So, I mean, it seems kind of common sense there, right? Alright, so this truck seems to struggle a little bit with fun. Uh, but it can move pretty quick, so... I gotta remember, it is kind of on the top heavy side, just because of the uh, fan body here. I love how every hill is just pure mud. I feel like if it was this much mud, if that slope, it would just slide down the hill. Okay, let's try not to roll over. It's, uh, it's very hard for me these days not to roll over. So. Just kind of have to go slow. Take it easy. Slow and easy, that's the way you do it. Alright, so we've got to go... I guess to the right. We're gonna not go over that bridge because it's a complete nightmare. Yeah, we're gonna have to head up maybe this trail here. This uh, this map looks like it. Absolute destruction of blood. I don't know, maybe every map's like that. I, I really only got the storyline from Michigan saying that there was a flood and that that's why... Ooh, we have to think about this one. I think we sneak down the river? We could come up that way, but then we'll be on the wrong side of the river. So I'm going to go for it. I'm going to try to sneak under this bridge. And... Uh, destroy my truck in the process. But the good thing is, I've got plenty of spare parts on it again, so... Sneak under here. Good thing there's this tree here. You probably would have been SOL. Now we're stuck on the tree that saved us. Let's grab that winch point way up there. Hopefully it's one that doesn't move. Or rip out. Oh, that's what I was afraid of. <laughs> Alright. That one that's gonna hold? Probably not. Did it get me to the birch tree? Yes, it did. That's all we need. Nice solid tree to pull ourselves through this mess. And hopefully not, uh, hopefully not roll over. Definitely not gonna head up that way. We're gonna have to go all the way around. Yeah, I think we are. Uh, it looks like the garage is that way. I'm gonna guess that's what this is. So, uh, you know, while we're here, we're stopped. Let's go ahead and fix our own suspension. You know, we'll just fix everything in the truck. That should uh, hopefully help us get through this mud. Oh, you gotta love that high gear. Alright, where, where do we go? We got... We don't have an easy task in front of us, do we? There's no way we're getting up there. Come on. 
on a big chair. <laughs> Upgrade somewhere up there. Oh, we stalled out. Not surprising. Not surprising. Alright, I'm hoping we can sneak up through here and just weave our way through the uh, forest. Where are we at here? We're gonna make our way back. Probably would have been smarter to do this with a scout. But you know me, I don't like to do things smartly, I just like to do things. And sometimes that doesn't uh, work out very well. <laughs> I, think, I think these woods are pretty wide open. We should be able to get a path through here. Go on a first person mode. Maybe we can squeeze through. A little hung up. Should've went right, should've went right, went the wrong way, right. Okay, maybe we can turn around here. Where is this upgrade? There it is! I'm driving around it. Alright, well, we'll just get back this up. Oh, we got a rock piece there, that's not good. Okay. Gotta be careful with these tandem trailers, because they like to like to push you over when you're back in so. Alright, we got an upgrade. Uh, let's check the map. This is where it is. Let's... There we go. <laughs> so we're way over there. That's the one of the entrance to the, from the quarry. Where's the other entrance to the quarry? Isn't there two of them? I could have sworn there was two of them. Alright, we must not have found it yet. But that's where we are, right there. That's where you can find the upgrade for a lot of trucks. Good size, 5.3 liter V8 engine. That's turbo charge. That's my guess of what all those initials mean. But anyways, there we go. We've got that. What does that say? Oh, the engine's available for purchase. All right. Do we dare go over to... You know what? If we can get to there, we can go hit up that and then come around this way. We're gonna just, we're gonna probably stay off main trails. <laughs> now we'll use, we'll use main trails. I think we can easily get through these woods. That's one of the nice things about Russia. A lot of these woods are uh, traversable. We go this way. In fact, I think they see the woods right there. Oh look, boss car, sweet. I'm guessing we gotta drag this thing somewhere. It's maybe a good uh, task for the uh, the TEZ 420. Let's go ahead and accept it. Start tracking it just for fun. Uh, so we have an abandoned car here, and we gotta bring it to the warehouse. So. Killing me, Smalls. It's killing me. It's not over. There, I feel like there was something around here. No? Okay, good. Oh, 
it's not going to get through. Let's see, can we reach? Not a tree like that. Probably don't need to be hauling this uh, giant thing of fuel behind me, but I'd be useless without it. Until we get a garage unlocked. Which I'm I am tempted to come over here and see if this is the garage. I'm assuming it is, but I'm also thinking that we probably need the uh, we probably need to hit up that rush tower. That may unlock the garage itself, so I'm tempted to go for the uh the rush tower. No, don't tip over. Oh, that was... No, 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 no. That almost tipped over. That definitely almost tipped over. I'm glad I aborted that one. Man, this thing is so top-heavy. So top-heavy. Alright. This looks like these look like the uh, the same buildings that were in. Uh, is it the Drownlands? I think it was the Drownlands. Where was the rift? No, it was the rift. All right, let's try to sneak through here. I mean, <laughs> it probably would have been better off. Although this might be the garage. No, I think that's the uh, or the waypoint. Let's just keep going for it. We've got plenty of fuel, which... I'm gonna go ahead and refuel now. Nope! Sorry, screwed that up. There we go. Well, it's a good thing we didn't technically run out of fuel. Although that would have been a nice little bug, because it takes, it takes a little bit to uh, start these trucks up. Once they run out of fuel, once you bleed them dry, uh, they don't just start up when you uh, when you put fuel in. So you usually have to do some priming. All right, well, let's uh, let's not worry about that too much right now. What are these railroad ties? Like why is there a crosswalk in the middle of the woods? That makes no sense whatsoever. Yeah, they're definitely railroad ties. Oh, look, it was a railroad track. That's why. All right, well, I guess that makes sense. Something came through, cut the, the rails out of the way so that we don't have to worry about it. Look at this. Are we already? Holy crap, we're already in the morning. That was getting, that was getting dark way too quick. Normally it takes almost a full episode to go through, uh, go through the, uh, the light, but... Oh, why did I go back to the quarry? I didn't, I didn't mean to do that. That's no, okay. Where, where is this? Oh, we're in the middle of nowhere. That's a, that's a weird edge to the map. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, it's still no task. There's supposed to be a bunch of tasks over here that never showed up. And uh, anyways, I'm not gonna worry about them. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if we if we can't get them to to activate. I'm just gonna have to bypass them. And not worry about them. Um, unfortunately, it, it is what it is, right? All right, so it stuck us. We came in here, but it stuck us way over here. That's not, uh, that's not very good. Well, you know what? We're gonna just go for it. We're gonna cut through here. Oh, that's a long ways. It's probably dumb on my part. No lying there. Maybe we can follow the railroad tracks? I mean, 
you think this would be pretty easy going. Probably a big mission. Looks like we got a trailer garage, so that's convenient. Let's try to get out of here without uh, tipping over and ruining our day. I'm gonna have to do like a 12 point turn. <laughs> and nobody wanted that fence there anymore, anyway, so. Uh, technically, I could have drove through that fence, but. Oh, look at that! A nice symbol to the uh, USSR. That's, that's pretty. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's stay on the road. Definitely do not walk off the road. Especially this close to... Uh, I'm hoping this is the garage. So let's accept that. Let's start tracking that one. So we need a concrete slab. We're probably going to need a lot of items for this. I kind of hope we... I hope it's not just a, oh, drop off concrete slabs, boom, the bridge is done. Where did all the metal come from? Where did all the uh, asphalt come from? Where did the wood come from? Alright, so they gave us a trailer store in, in basically inside of a mud pit. Sell that back. Still no garage though, huh? Where is the garage? Well, where do we gotta go? We gotta pick up concrete slabs. Yeah, it looks like concrete slabs are probably in. Probably in the quarry? Yep, we got, oh, we gotta go down to the quarry. Yep, it's going to be one of them. Let's see here. We, uh, this is the closest where we go this way, which, I mean, we could go that way. We come in that quarry. It seems backwards, doesn't it? No, I guess, I guess that's right. Never mind. We've got a bridge here that I don't think we can get fixed. So to come that way doesn't make any sense at all. we got to come through this way, so... Yeah, that's going to make life uh, fun and interesting. Alright, well, you know what? Let's, uh, let's go see what this is over here. Start tracking that one, see what that one's like. Ooh, yeah, we're gonna need a crane, aren't we? What is this? That's my truck. Never mind. <laughs> that's the one we left there. That's the one that's on its side. There's. Wow, there's four of them all over the place. Yep, we're gonna need a truck with a crane. We're gonna need a flatbed truck with. Concrete slabs on it. We're gonna need a lot of stuff to get these on. 
tasks on. These are just the tasks. Oh, there's, there's plenty of content for this, uh, for this area, so. gonna do? I'm gonna make some money. And just like that, we made $3,400. <laughs> oh, that was easy. We're gonna not worry about these things. jump into the uh the as off that's not the outside probably should have put some fuel on this we're gonna go attempt to rescue this one that is a long ways no lie there do do we have fuel we have fuel on this don't we okay Scared me for a second. <laughs> Let's, uh, yeah, we should be fine to go through this. It's just, yeah, we'll use the length of this truck to, uh, span over that gap. No! Oh, that was super close. That was super close. Am I going? Oh, I do want to this way. Let's back up. Let's try to get the truck. Love all before we go through the mud. There we go. Oh, that would have been devastating. I would have had to bust out maybe the, uh, the MK38 civilian, or maybe I'd bust out the cat. I, I'm kind of itching to die to try the cat. Differential and the old little guy. I really wish I could remember what that truck had on it, or was missing, I guess. Because I remember it missing one of the two. It was either the all-wheel drive or it was the differential. I want to say it was the all-wheel drive. Uh, which I think is what hurt it for, like, logging. Except for the fact that I don't think it does long logs, I think it can only do it. And it doesn't take a trailer, so... But if you got medium logs, I think that's the truck that is just all those Everything. I definitely want to try it out this morning. Alright, so I'm going to have to go, yeah. I'm just going to go to the end of this road, take a left. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not looking forward to doing the slaps. <laughs> going down into the quarries, just, I don't know what it is. I was traumatized by the quarries, so that's one of the last things I want to go to. Got to, got to do it. Unless we, unless we find a better spot to pick the slaps, but I don't remember there being Guessing this was the end of the road. Yes. Yeah, so. Here we want to go left. Not through the brush. Look at how much better. Look at how much better that was instead of going through all that mud. 
was it was really nice for somebody to come through here and put some logs down. Oh, they screwed up there. They should have put logs there. Who knows how bad this was for them to put logs there. Come on, you can do it. We're almost there. We're almost there. Where are we? We need to go straight and through. Okay. There's no uh, there's consumable way over there. Uh, there's an upgrade. I knew there was an upgrade around here somewhere. Maybe we'll get the uh, we'll get the Az off put on its heels and then and then we'll uh, we'll get that upgrade. Stupid rock that tipped us over. Let's see if we can work ourselves in here. I learned a big lesson the last time I came through and tried to put the truck on its side. Uh, you don't ever want to just pull from the side of a truck. It's, it's probably going to flip you over. Alright, that should be good there. Let's attach the winch. Highest point. And, yeah, that wasn't the truck, that was the tree. That? There we go. And, ta-da! That should be. Alright, let's uh, change trucks. Let's change trucks again, because I forgot to shut this one off. Fire this one up. Let's refill. That's not where I want it. I want that one. Let's fill up the end as well. Fill up everything. There we go. We got 201 gallons left in there, so that truck is completely usable still. Am I dumb for going straight for it? Yes. yes I am. But that's okay. I can admit it. Since I can admit it, I can, uh, boulder come from? Was that boulder there? Did I just not see it? Let's actually go this way. I'm gonna try to get in a fight with the giant Douglas fur. Alright, there's a little trail here. There's a rock there that's probably going to want us to put this over. There it is. For the uh, upgrade. Boom! A raised suspension for oh the step 310E. So that's that's what we were looking for to be able to put the bigger tires on it. So uh, yeah, and the location of that one is right there. So there you go. All right, so let's try to get out of this mess without. Um, Ruining our day. Yes, yeah, we're going to go to the left here. Squeeze through there. Yes, Alright, let's go see what this is. This looks like a lumber yard. Nope, nope, I'm not, I'm not, I've had too many close calls with rolling over today, so I'm not going down there. Here. We don't see any trailers. That's a bummer. I would, I would love to see a trailer with a bunch of slabs of uh, concrete on. That would be convenient. This is definitely a lumber yard, but um, yeah, it's not activated. It's not. Uh, it's not anything. I think it's completely useless to us. 
yeah, there's the uh, sawmill. So, yeah, I guess they just didn't want to activate it. I don't know. Maybe it's something you can activate later in, uh, in a mission. That looks like there's definitely something down there. Can we go check it out? You know what? Let's do it. My guess though, it's, it's like a Hummer or a Jeep or something. I can't really tell. Or is it a Unimog? What is that? Whatever it is, I can't attach to it. Maybe it's a tractor. Yeah, I'm thinking it's a tractor. That's horribly unfortunate. Doesn't it look like there should be something over here? Like, developers, this is what I, this is what I, bugs me. It's like, how is there not? You know, I'm not even gonna attempt it because I know from experience that nothing is over there. Anyways, let me know in the comments if you guys know if there is something over there, because if there is, I want to go get it. We're just gonna push ourselves out of here real quick. But yeah, there's so many, there's so many parts of the map that have these little annexes where if you drive through the river and you can get to an island, you think there would be something there, but there's not. I don't care if every single one has something, but I want one of them to have something sooner or later. Anyways, yeah, let me know in the comments. Don't tell me what it is. Just let me know if something's there. Although lately, I probably only have like 10 views, so... For me, uh, there may, uh, no, maybe nobody will know if there's something there, so... Um, keep looking out for stuff, because I feel like there should be more things over here. Oh, you know what? Let's go for this upgrade here. And then I think we'll call it an episode. So there's a tractor. tractors all over the place. Still not, I still have not come across farming, so I don't know when that is. They're hanging out of the corner of a house. I think I'm gonna go left. I think I'm definitely gonna go left. Somewhere back here. Probably would have been easier to go through the fence. I still don't see the upgrade. Right through there? Yep, we made it. Hi, there it is. Jeez. My arm. This is really knocked off the fence. Yes, yeah. I'm guessing we probably should look to the other side. We probably came at this at the worst possible. These trees I may not be. Uh, let's see if we can get that birch tree right between them. I don't know what I was thinking. We are pretty much in here. Alright. And we get this upgrade. Nope. Stuck on the tree there. <laughs> get me in there. Get me in there. Get me in there. Thank you. 
Alright, so this is where this upgrade is. Let's check the map real quick. Clear all that out. We're right in the middle of this town. Right by the water, so... Um, let's hopefully uh, get a good upgrade here. Oh, look at that! We found the engine for this truck. And it's for a couple other trucks too, so... Awesome! Sweet! Uh, yeah, let's let's try to get out of here. Yep, there we go. It helps if I uh Hope you guys enjoyed the new rebranding of Dilly Squat Gaming into DSG. I, I don't know if I'm going to keep that. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, I almost want to say DS Gaming. Uh, but then that reminds me of Nintendo. So that one I may get sued over. Who knows? Uh, but yeah. So we are going to... Uh, you know what? I'm going to check out this factory real quick. I think it's close. I want to say factories are where you can get concrete slabs sometimes, but I'm, I'm still not certain where the uh, where the garage is that we're supposed to unlock. It's, it's kind of strange. I don't know. This is a small gap. Let's see what we can pick up here. Metal beans. That's it. All right. Well, at least we know where metal beans are if we need them. Let's go ahead and shut down the engine. Um, yeah, so let me know what you guys think. Where is this garage? I mean, is this garage right here and we just haven't done it yet? This kind of makes the most sense because those are repair bays. I don't know. I don't see anything that looks like a garage according to the garages we've uh, we've had in the past, so it's an oil drilling platform, there's a factory, metal delivery, there's a task, that's a town, this is a lumber mill, and this is like a little farm thing, so yeah, I don't know. Anyways, we're going to end the episode there, so I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give me a thumbs up, and if you're not subscribed, please subscribe, because 50% of people who watch aren't subscribed. So if you could subscribe, I could get to 500, and I could be I'm thinking I get monetized at that point. And uh, yeah, to make 13 cents per episode, per thousand views, or whatever it is, would be amazing. So uh, we will see you in the next one. Bye for now.